Hey guys, the Taiwan series is finished now. That was an absolutely amazing trip. I might even say it's been one of my favorites so far. Taiwan was such an amazing place with such a rich culture, amazing martial arts, and I learned a lot on that trip. It was a real eye-opener. Now, I'm back here in Australia, and the owner of the dojo where I practice Brazilian Jiu-Jitsu, Christian Ching, the other day invited his karate teacher, Yoshiji Sueno, over for a seminar. Now, I'm not a karate practitioner myself, but it's not every day you get the chance to train with the founder of a style. So I took the opportunity to go along to the seminar. I jumped in and practiced a little bit. I filmed a little bit, and I was very, very fortunate that at the end of it, I got to sit down with Master Sueno for a few minutes to ask him a few questions about the style. So in short, Sueno was a student of Masoyama, and he later went on to create his own style, called Shidokan Karate. So Shidokan became famous for its triathlon style fighting events. So essentially what happens is you fight one round Kyokushin Karate rules, you fight one round kickboxing rules, and then you fight one round MMA rules. So you're kind of upping the progression of like how free the rules get. <laughs> シドカンの so the, 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 the triathlon of karate, as they, they sometimes call it, is... is, is so the samurai rule is first round is karate, second round is kickboxing, third round is, is MMA. And that came about because they were developing a style that would help, like in, for example, the police to combat gangs and, and to keep order, was to have a very well-rounded set of skills across all different. So they created what they call samurai rules, which is those three rounds of different disciplines, but you start with one and then they expand and become more and more. あの、空手やって and also, from what I understand, he trained under Masoyama, right? Would he be able to talk a little bit about that? Maybe some, some stories of his experience with, with Oyama Sensei? <laughs> シカゴのエディさんたちはギャングと戦ってるから体張ってるから体の試合はそこまでやんないんですよ。その差、差がですか。進化してるから体は。で、今の極真のルールはスポーツでしちゃってる。昔のとちょっと違ってる。顔叩かないから前の伸びりでボディこんなこと叩いちゃって。顔面丸開きだから。それは極極真やと顔面
昔のほらあの空手対キックの試合は蹴ってくるとカットの仕方が分かんないから下がって蹴られるから黒崎戦蹴られるでしょで自分たちも対って戦った時にあの蹴りは何だってやられないと分かんないからそ,でそれでキックボクシングトレーニングアンダーソーサイオヤマは the very traditional karate and before there were not as many rules it was very much more rounded but Kyokushin now has rules to it and if you are to compete with a rule segment but in the street it can be very dangerous so the idea behind uh, Sosui to, to create Shirokan was to create a more well-rounded style that incorporated Kyokushin and the full contact and the, and the power of, of that into obviously today's world. <laughs>
hook. The timing of the foot landing. If they defend, defend, their defense is this side. The hook is there. So here. Punches to set up other things, but also your guard is like a offense, right? Oops. Defense is like offense. Oops. So if we can punches four straights, I want to feel like I'm strong on it. If Oops. I go here and he punches, my hands are up, but my body's not, not strong, all right? So here. But, but, but. Strong on the defense. Thumbs on the eyebrows, gloves are tight. Okay. Protect your center line. Elbows to the ribs. So, I'm going to do it now to Lincoln. Okay, so, ba, 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 ba. I turn on this, setting up the liver shot. Ba, So, Lincoln goes, bum, 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 bum. Liver shot. Drop here. If you're, if I'm here, it's very hard to check. here. Okay, so yes. you're on the other side. Yeah. Brace. Especially yes. yes. if you're fighting tomorrow. Oz, 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 under his ankle, but the toes are under my armpit already. Awesome. So from here, I sit back, this foot goes here in the hip awesome. to block his hip from moving. So now I have the leg, awesome. I need the end here. I sit back on my shoulder awesome. and look behind as I sit not for the for the straight this side but this one well, I hope you guys enjoyed that. It's a little bit different to the Chinese martial arts that I show on the channel most of the time. But I thought, you know, it's not every day that you get the chance to talk to the actual founder of, of a style and, you know, one of the great legends of the martial arts world. So if Shidokan Karate is something that you're interested in, I'm going to try and talk to Christian another time and get him to give a little bit more of an in-depth um, interview with us about what exactly Shidokan is, you know, what sort of main principles and ideas of the system are and how it all kinds of fits together. So if that's something you're interested in, leave a comment below and we'll try and sort that out soon.